Om Shanti, welcome back. We are doing the recording on 22nd of August. Now, this is a recording which I am doing beforehand because I will be travelling in the train tomorrow back to Darjeeling. And I hope I can send this recording to you on time. But if it doesn't come to you on time, let's hope that on 23rd when I reach of August I will be able to put it up, load it online, provided my internet signals are good when I am travelling in the train. So, what does the Supreme Father have to say over here and how he wants us to experience the challenges which all of us face in our life on a s- every single day basis? So, we are going to explore this area of our life. Everybody's life is full of challenges. We make mistakes sometimes on our own, sometimes our family members, people around us, and organization, they make mistakes and sometimes it comes on to us. We have to suffer sometimes, right? So, God says, may you be a special soul who experiences spiritual pressure in every test by being ever ready what does that mean by being ever ready the confluence age now this is the age which is known as the confluence age is the age to have spiritual pleasure and this is why you have to stay constantly in pleasure and never get confused why it happened to me what did i do i've always done good to people other the other day i was with my friend's family and the mother was saying that I am from a very small city and she was complaining that being in Delhi I have never done anything bad to anybody but why do I have to suffer so much? Why the suffering comes to me more even if I have not done anything bad to anybody? So God then says over here that if we are not constantly in pleasure and we get confused why me then the confusion increases. See, the energy flows where the attention goes. So the energy is flowing towards the problem. And the problem is getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Because you are giving reasons to it. You are attaching more reasons. Why? And most of the reasons when we are thinking of the problem are complaining, blaming, complaining, blaming, criticizing, putting people down. And when we are doing that, the problem becomes bigger and the solution becomes smaller. Because the source of the problem which we are, are making ourselves less spiritual by complaining, criticizing, comparing, competing, putting other people down and we are losing our creative energy when we are putting people down or criticizing, complaining and that's how we find it difficult, more and more difficult every single day to find solutions to our problems because we are losing this pure spiritual energy to find solutions to that problem. So God then says that constantly in pleasure and never get confused. If your thoughts are confused for even a short time about any situation or test, that moment happens to be your final moment. Then they would be your final thoughts to lead you to your destination. Now, final thoughts to lead you to a destination could be compared to what I'm thinking right now, what you're thinking right now about a situation or problem, and then the destination is our thoughts carry us and mostly our feelings carry us to a de- destination. More than our thoughts also. So thoughts are feelings and feelings, how we feel them, decide where exactly are we going. Whether we are going to be in more of a dire situation. Because the problem which we are thinking about, we are thinking from a very impure or a negative angle or or an angle of uh, trouble. Or we are in happiness and pleasure no matter what and then being in that happiness and pleasure and without the worry constraint we are in that higher state and finding solutions then the destination is going to be different so worry comparison competition complaining criticism destination is a more of trouble and being in pleasure and happiness content the destination changes to b solution so then god says therefore what would be your condition Therefore, remain constantly ever ready. So, if you are thinking about the situation in a very negative way, then A is your condition. If you are thinking in pleasure and happiness and contentment, then B is your destination. So, how will it be? How will your condition be? Think about it. So, therefore, God says, remain constantly ever ready. Let no problem become an obstacle to your becoming complete. Complete means, when something is complete... An instrument is complete. It doesn't give us trouble. It doesn't show any kind of glitches. 
when we are complete we also don't give troubles to others we don't get troubled by ourselves and we don't have any glitches glitches are ego jealousy hatred comparison competition criticism blame work and all these things are glitches within us so when we are complete we don't have these glitches god then says let no problem become an obstacle to you becoming complete always have the awareness i am most valuable special soul in the world imagine this i am most valuable special soul in the world how does that feel my every thought word and action is special let not a second be wasted my every thought word and action is special i am a hero actor in this world drama i am a special soul i am the most valuable soul in this world imagine working acting thinking talking from that advantage point with this affirmation how would it feel now this is what we learn in brahma kumaris we try to move ourselves to a higher vibration level so that everything which we think talk and act is different from the world not ordinary as you learned in the yesterday's vartan not ordinary extraordinary you too can learn this with this om shanti